Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be basically because of y'all's request. I asked y'all the other day on Instagram stories what y'all wanted to see coming up and it was kind of overwhelming with the fact that y'all wanted to see vlog style, y'all wanted to see more home stuff, y'all wanted to see more beauty stuff, and just like things that I've been buying during this whole stay at home order. That is what I'm gonna share with you guys in today's video. We're in my closet, I just finished getting dressed. I haven't been getting dressed every single day. I actually recently did a chemical pill. That's another thing that I wanted to chat with you guys about. I recently did the VI pill on my face. I had so many of, so like so many questions about the process and everything. I did talk about that on Instagram and kind of give my little mini review on stories. But the biggest question that I was asked because I said that I didn't recommend this pill for at home, even though I did it at home, I didn't really know any better. I think it's a great pill. It really, really works, but I definitely recommend doing it like under the supervision of a professional. So I had so many of y'all ask what I did recommend at home. So I'm gonna show you some of my like recommended exfoliant, like exfoliation, like chemical type peels that you can do at home. I'll show you guys that later. But like I said, I just finished getting dressed. I'm gonna put some perfume on. This is like my all time favorite perfume. This one and this one, you guys, I think I have a brand new bottle of this uh, you can see I'm almost out this is a fairly new bottle this smells heavenly you guys I just love this stuff oh, this is my stock of the day I have been wearing this every single day for the last few days I love it it's just so different right it's really really fun I still haven't gotten my new watch size so I'm wearing this is my two-tone one but once I get my new watch size that'll probably be my new everyday watch but I love this perfume. If you're looking for a good like perfume, check out this one or this one. They're very different. They're both florals, but florals done in a very different way. This is very light, fresh, and like romantic and just beautiful and soft, great for every day. And this one definitely is a little bit more sultry and it's just, it smells so amazing and it's like timeless and classic and perfect for any age. But I'm gonna go ahead and go grab a few things that I wanted to share with y'all. I'll be right back. I realized I didn't have my necklace on. I've also been wearing this necklace like every single day. It's my favorite. I really love this one. Simple, but pretty. Okay, so I pulled one, two, three, four, five different at home like chemical type of products that you can put on your skin. You Some of these are daily, some of these are once or twice a week. It really just depends on your skin type and that's not something that I can necessarily say specifically because you have to go with your gut and based on your skin. So first up, let's go ahead and do, okay, so these are something that you can use every single day. I do use these every single day. This These are the resurfacing pads by Elemis, love these, and these are the um, acid glycol acid peel pads from Colleen Rothschild. Love them both. This is something that you can use every single day. Most skin types can do this every single day. Obviously, if you're extremely sensitive, then maybe just a few times a week, but this is something that you can use every single day. Now, obviously a you know professional peel that you do at the dermatologist or esthetician is not going to be nearly as uh, like this is very very light compared to that basically so don't expect to get the same results but if you use these every single day over time you will notice a difference on your skin another every single day option is something like this this is actually by pixie super super affordable i'll link all of these down below this is the glow tonic again you can use this every single day at, like it's your toner you put it on a cotton pad and just kind of wipe it over time you're gonna notice a difference in the brightness of your skin basically the whole point of these peels is to exfoliate your skin and have the freshest skin possible the more professional peels that you get at the dermatologist or esthetician are just taking off more layers of skin to expose the freshest skin that's like deep down whereas these are slowly taking off those top layers so you will notice a difference over time if you're consistent and as far as masks these are my favorite too. This one right here is super affordable. It's under like $10. I love this. This is an AHA and BHA peeling uh, solution. I love this stuff and it just kind of looks kind of fun. So you can do this a couple of times a week, again, depending on your skin type. And this is the one that I've been using recently. I actually have talked about this one in several recent videos. Again, this is a glycolic lactic acid uh, mask. So you can, again, use this one a couple of times a week. 
I really love this one. I think this one's around 50, 60 bucks. So it's obviously more expensive than this one, but I do recommend both. They're very, very different as far as texture. This one is like kind of like liquidy and watery. And this one is definitely like a gel formula. So all of these products are going to do a light version of what the VI peel did. And then over time, you're going to notice a difference in your skin as long as you are consistent. Speaking of beauty products that I am loving, I wanted to share a few new products that I just got in from Billy. So I've been talking about Billy for quite a while. I am actually just a regular customer of Billy. And then shortly after I signed up to be a customer, they reached out to me and I am a Billy partner now, which I actually love that I'm able to partner up with a company that I am naturally organically a customer of. Anyway, I've always struggled with with shaving if you've been watching my channel for a while i've talked about it in the past where i've always just had and gotten razor burn and like a, almost like a razor rash after shaving just always and i always just thought it was like my particular skin type it was something that i thought i would always struggle with i had no idea it had to do with the type of razor that i was using and ever since i started using the billy razor I don't have that issue anymore, you guys. I'm not kidding. This razor is seriously life-changing. It is a subscription. Make sure to check out the link down below. You can start your subscription for like $9. It's super affordable and they have the cutest like colors and styles. I, of course, went for this like blush pink color. So like I said, I'm a regular customer. So my razors come in every single month, but because I'm a Billy partner, they also send me things from time to time. And they recently just sent me this razor cover, which I just think is really cute. Like how cute is that? They also sent me their shave cream which I do love but I will say because the fact that the razor is surrounded by this charcoal soap I don't even need a shave cream and that's actually saying a lot because of how sensitive my skin is however I still love the way this one feels if you struggle or have ever struggled with razor burn or razor issues just in general you guys have got to try this razor and they also sent me the body wash so I've only used this a couple of times but I love the way that it feels and I love the way that it smells. It's really, really like fresh and citrusy. Check out the links down below to get started. So I just got this ottoman in. I shared it with y'all on Instagram and y'all loved it. I love the price point. It is super affordable. It's like $130. The size is perfect for this space, but I think just in general, it's a really, really nice size ottoman and it looks way more expensive than it is. I've seen these other places that were way more expensive. You can see I'm hanging out in my joggers today. Speaking of, these joggers are one of my faves. They're so comfortable, and then this tee is one of my faves as well, but I love this. Oh, are you okay, Miss Patoons? Are you okay, Bubbles? Are you okay? <laughs> Look at that smile. Um, but yes, if you're looking for an ottoman, I'm actually already thinking of a few other places or at least one other place that I can buy another one to put in the house because I just think it's too pretty just to leave it cooped up here in my office. Like I want it like out and about so people can see it because I just think it's so, so pretty. You're gonna hurt your feet, sees. Come here. Oh, come here, babies. Is that better? Is that better? I am still waiting. I just ordered another um, chair right here. So I'll have two, both of these chairs right here will match. So I'll have one chair there and one chair there. And then I also recently just got this rug in. Bless you. If you're looking for an area rug, you've got to check this one out. It comes in basically every size you could imagine. The colors in it are stunning. I love the colors. Hey, Patoons. Um, but I also just love the fact that there is no weave to it. It's almost like, if you look, there is no weave to it. It's almost like a matte material. So this is great for pets. You don't have to worry about them snagging their nails or anything. But then also because I have the rolling chairs, because there's no shag or anything to it, the wheels just glide perfectly on this carpet. But look at all the colors. It's just such a beautiful rug. I love it and it matches perfectly with my new ottoman. So I just wiped my lip combo off because I wanted to do it on camera because I have been loving this combo. So I've talked about this lipstick before a lot on my channel. It is in the color Almost Bare. I'll link it down below. So I have nothing on my lips. I wiped it off. No lip liner and I'm just gonna put this, look at that color. It is literally the perfect like pinky nude shade and the formula is amazing. And then I'm going to top it with that lip gloss that I shared with you all the other, well, honestly, I think I've shared this with you guys a lot. This is in the color Opal. Again, I'll link this down below as well. 
Look at this combo. It is such a good everyday combo. It's kind of been my go-to. I just love this kind of like really natural, like nudie pink look. But I'm sitting here in my sitting room and I just wanted to share that with you guys because like I said, I know y'all have been asking for more beauty stuff. Um, I did change up my sitting room a little bit. I've got a rack of clothing there, so just ignore that. I brought these lamps from my living room in here and I really like the way that they look. I, I talked about this flower. This is a faux orchid. I talked about this in my recent home favorites video. If you haven't watched that video, you've got to check it out if you love home decor and stuff like that. I think I share my top 10 like home decor like pieces that is one of them if you haven't ordered this faux flower trust me i've got two of them i've got one in here in my sitting room i've also got one on my vanity in the master bedroom and i i just love it they look so beautiful for the price point faux flowers are expensive you guys and i just love the way uh these really look i, I would buy more but i think two is probably enough it's like really really hard to find nice good quality faux flowers anyways i just wanted to share this little space with you obviously my lipstick and lip gloss are on there not typical and i still have my shades and stuff like that i have some pillows that are on the way they still haven't arrived some things it's so funny because some things are getting here really really early and and quickly and then some things are taking forever and you really just don't know but there's so many things and changes that are happening i'm still waiting on all my patio furniture i just ordered this egg chair I love it you guys if you are looking for an egg chair you definitely should get one one they're just so cute but the one that i ordered i literally stalked the website every single day multiple times waiting for it to come back in stock And when i saw it was in stock i ordered it immediately i found a couple of other ones that i thought were really cute as well i can link some down below for y'all but minnie just came and joined me hey minnows they're in there like eating their breakfast and stuff but Anyways, I'm gonna go grab some lunch because I am hungry. The boys already ate earlier. My eating schedule is so off. I don't eat breakfast until later and then that means my lunch goes to later. So I'm gonna go grab something to eat real quick. I am finally gonna tackle the laundry that is behind the camera. I have been avoiding it for two days, not even lying. Laundry is the worst. I hate having to put away all the laundry. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna run the robot vacuum and do just like a little bit of cleaning. You take my love for granted Say a bunch of stuff you never mean, yeah those eyes is she not the best thing she's just the sweetest baby i get tons of questions about her asking like how old she is well we don't really know exactly how old she is she's been with us maybe two and a half three years and they estimated when um you know i rescued her that she was like 10 to 12 years old so she is definitely getting up there she definitely has a lot of health issues. The biggest issue that she has is her heart. And because of her heart, it makes it hard for um, us to really work on anything because she can't be put under. But she does take heart medicine twice a day. But she's doing really, really good right now. And you hear Bella panting. She just got in from inside. But that's Miss Patoons. Miss Patoons. Right. And this is Lexi, and I remember the day that I found her and rescued her. I went into a pet store, PetSmart, Petco, and she was, it was in one of those like pet adoption days, and she was so, like she was not having it. She was in an awful mood, she was cranky, she hated obviously being in the cage, we were new people to her, and so she was actually quite aggressive. And I just, there was something about her that I just wanted I, I knew I wanted to give her a home. Those eyes that you can't see right now because she's sleeping, there was just something about her. And she's been with us. She was our first cat. We got her, oh man, forever ago when we lived back in an apartment. So she's probably 
15 years old or so. She's really, really old because when we got her, she was already a couple of years old. Well, maybe not 15. She's probably about 12 years old, I would say. And she is the most affectionate kitty. Very, very high maintenance. Right, Lexi? Yes, I'm talking about you. She's very, very high maintenance, but this is basically her life. She sleeps, cuddles, eats, and loves all the lovin's, don't ya? Oh. <laughs> this is Minnie and this is Izzy. They were actually rescued at the same time. We rescued them during the adoption process, right at the very beginning when we were still in the foster process before we even met the boys. So we've had both of them about seven years. They were supposed to be fosters. They were foster failures, so obviously we kept them. So this is their forever home now. But because they came to us at the same time, they are literally like best friends. They cuddle together all the time. They definitely fight every once in a while just like sisters right but they're best friends and you guys can never tell them apart so izzy has a lot more black in her face and minnie has a lot more do you see how there's a lot more tan here and then more tan here they definitely have completely different personalities minnie thinks she is the protector and she's constantly cleaning all of her sister's ears and I, she's such a good little sister. And Izzy is very, very shy and nervous, but you can tell Minnie was definitely abused in the previous home because she definitely has a few things that she does that just is clear that she kind of has those like insecurities and stuff. But they're both just so cute. Look at those faces. Hello? Hello? <laughs> so that's most of the pack. I think all that's left is Bella. So I just got a couple of deliveries. I honestly have no clue what is in this box right here. It was really heavy. Obviously, it's something I ordered. It's from Walmart, but I don't remember what to be honest. Um, this one is from Amazon, and I'm so excited. I've got so many good things in here. So, um, I have been wanting to get these slippers in the gray color for so long. Oh, uh, they're so comfortable. Look at these. I love them, and they're like I don't know, $12 or something like that. Love, love these. These are so cute. Love the color as well. I also ordered some sunglasses. I'll link all of these down below. Let me try them on. And I'll have to look at myself and see which ones I like. But these also were all around like $12. I think the most expensive pair of sunglasses was $15. But I just wanted to buy a few like more affordable pairs oh these look really cute and they feel really comfortable these actually feel really comfortable so i'll link these down below in the order that i share them so these will be sunglasses number one really cute i love the they're a gold frame and it's got kind of like a smoky lens so i love those next up is I have, I ordered, I think five or six pair. So I really don't know. And I only got three in this delivery. So I won't be able to show you all of them. And these are a black frame with a black lens. Ooh, I love these. Also very, very comfortable. I really like these. What do you think? So these will be sunglasses too. Like I said, I'll link them down below. Those are really cute too. Loving those. Those are, I don't, these are not the same. I don't think. I don't, I don't know if they're the same, just different colors. I'll, I'll look them up and I'll, like I said, I'll link them down below. And this is the last pair that I got in this delivery. This one actually came with like a nice little case. This looks like a sporty, like a sporty one. Oh, oh, I'm so excited for these. I was so excited. I shared these on um, a daily 10 the other day, like last week. Oh, I'm so by the time this this video goes live last week, I love the studded detail of these. They have they're a gold frame with like a smoky black lens and then they've got the studs all the way around them. Really cute. How do they look on? I can't tell. I'll have to look after, but I'll link these down below as well. They feel really comfortable as well. These one don't feel as like I think those feel a little bit better as far as the quality of them. Um, but they still feel fine. They're not like loose or anything. They feel very lightweight. These are rimless on the bottom, which I personally like that. But there is no like, you know how right here at the end, there's usually like the soft pad like you have right here. Do you see that? 
these don't have that so it's just metal on the ears they definitely feel a little different on than you're used to but they look like they're really cute right so those are cute i'll link those down below and looks like i have two other things in this package i ordered a ton of like amazon sleepwear because y'all know how much i love my somas soma is just kind of my jam but a lot of y'all requested more affordable sleepwear so i was determined to find some that i could share with you guys the first thing that i have is this robe it is like a waffle material i got it in gray of course y'all know gray is my favorite i really like this it actually feels really nice the material isn't like itchy or anything it feels like it's gonna be oh yeah it's a really nice weight and it's just, I mean, it's a robe. I like this. It's got the white piping. This is really nice. And I think this was like $16, $18, $20. I'll link it down below. It came in a ton of colors. It came in navy black. I think like a maroon color, but I of course went for the gray. So I love that. And I think I got that in a, let me see. I think I got it in a small. I got it in a small, yeah. And then it looks like I have, is this a pajama set? or just a shirt let's see yes it is a pajama set i got this in a small so you've got the top oh this actually feels really good you guys i got this in a small this is bamboo rayon and elastane um love it it's got the little button detail there with the v-neck really cute of course i got the gray and then these are the pants elastic waist again i got a small these are like a capri which will probably fit me like a full length pant, but I'm liking this. The material is really, really nice. The test will be washing and drying them, but I think they're gonna be fine because of what the material is made out of. Hey, patoons. Um, machine wash with light colors, tumble dry low. So yeah, I think these are gonna be good. But that is everything I got from Amazon. And this is Mrs. Bella. We've had her the longest. So she's not the oldest in the house, but she's the oldest in regards to who has been with us the longest. We've had her since she was a puppy. So she is, I don't know, maybe 10 years old, which is actually pretty old for an English bulldog. She is definitely getting up there in age, but she's still just the cutest little thing. I am currently in the Chick-fil-A drive through grabbing some dinner for the fam, but I wanted to hop on here because I'm wearing my new Sunnies and I love them. They're like $14. I'll link them down below. I, I'm kind of obsessed. I think I might get a backup pair just to leave in my car because these are so cute and they feel really, really nice and comfortable on. They already fit my face perfectly. Like they're not hitting my cheeks or anything. I love them, you guys. Like I said, they'll be linked down below. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope I answered a lot of the questions that y'all have been asking. Everything, of course, will always be linked down below in the info box. And I will see you guys in the next one. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.